Hello, I'm Diarcos, and welcome back to my Factorio series. Okay, so we're just setting up... We have a blueprint here. Where is it? Right there. Okay. Something like this. Doesn't quite work because this is all yellow. Let me fix that. Um, okay, there we go. Oh, yeah. Power might be good. Let's see, where's the closest power? Okay, I think we are having to do something like that. And yeah, I am gonna let that fill up. And we'll do the same thing for iron and copper. We just need a good spot to do that. Let's see right here. You can see we're being attacked right now. Okay, we'll do copper right here. Let's I gotta pull it up first. It won't let me do it. There we go. And for iron, we will pull off the line. We'll kind of do it in reverse, I think. That would be good. And for these, I need to remember to. Uh, set up Let's put some lights down I need to remember to um, Add the the balancers like we have on the other ones I Guess it's not too bad because this is the end of the line for iron um, But I think for this one We should Balance up like this because that copper is going that way. Going up. Okay. First, we've got more speed modules being made very slowly. Probably get some beacons in there. What are these up to? I don't see any red. Okay. Just mainly put them in there. Okay, um, we are waiting on. We're waiting on red circuits still. That's that's fine. Okay, so let's, and we already have the green providers going right here, right? Green circuits, yeah. All right, that's filling up pretty nicely. I'll add that in there. It's a little farther away. We could probably move that whole thing down here. Um, since I do plan on using this area, I think I'm gonna do that just to make it a little faster. Let's uh, let's just turn this off, and we'll let those be used just like the other provider chests. We'll pick them up when they get emptied, and we'll move them down here so that everything is kind of all in one close area. Okay. And let's try the uh, stack inserters here. Just like that. <clears throat> Excuse me. Thought you were going to be powered up, dude. No? Right here? There we go. We'll drop a light. Okay. All right. We'll move, we can move some of this. Okay. We'll move all of these over to one. Go to that one. All right, cool. Okay. Um, so, while we're waiting on beacons, we can make some red, I think, up here. But we do need green circuits, we need copper cable, and we need plastic. Well, we're gonna need to, to box up plastic, I think. Um, so let's do that here. Okay. <clears throat> 
Here's plastic and we will do an underground for the rest of it. And I really should create a assembler for these stack inserters, I think. So I like using them, but I just don't remember to. I have a bunch of blue inserter inserters on me. What do we need for them? Just red circuits? Yeah, of course. Um, where are my circuits? Here? I don't have... Uh, so I'm getting to the point where I don't want to add anything over here to the belts, to the basic stuff. So I think everything I make from now on is going to be up in this region with the logistics. So if I want to add... If I want to make a sack inserter, I need to just... Um, create another assembler like that. But for plastic, I need to finish that. And I'll use... A regular inserter for now. We can fill that up. Yeah, that's gonna take a while. You get a stack inserter, definitely. Okay, that's my drop chest for stone. Okay, um, I don't see any reason why we shouldn't just fill those up as much as we can, so I will let that be unlimited. And we are making good. So if I see this start going down instead of up, which if I add more um, red circuits assemblers, then that's exactly what's going to happen. I'll just add more copper. And pretty soon we'll get beacons. And I'll, I'm, I'm not going to have them lined up like this. I'm going to have uh, it surrounded. Okay, let's go look at our... We had a yellow assembler, I think. Um, being crafted down here somewhere there he is yeah we got nine of them and then we ran out of red circuits so here's how we fix that actually let's do it up here <clears throat> should really actually let's do it like this um, how many does it give me four one two three four five okay all right these go a lot faster the, the blue assemblers are slower than you handcraft um, the yellow assemblers are faster they do everything at 1.25 the blue assemblers at 0.75 and you're at one, of course. Okay, so... It looks like this is a good spot to put this because at least blue um, circuits are still getting the red circuits. So we're still creating them, but it looks like it's pretty slow. Um, hopefully as we expand out our logistics network, we can... We can increase everything. Um, we are using a little bit more logistic bots, so I'm gonna keep an eye on that. And when it gets low, I'll start introducing more bots into the, the network. And what are these guys doing? They're waiting to charge. Okay, I'm gonna add another RoboPort right here because that looks like a pretty popular area. Just give them. If I see a lot of bots kind of waiting to charge up in a single spot, that kind of tells me that's the spot where they're they're running out of juice on their trips and they need um, they need more attention there. Oh, we've got damage into the south. I'm gonna go check that out. We've got three turrets, four turrets being damaged. They could be breaking through. Oh, don't get trapped by my own stuff. Switch over to flamethrower. <clears throat> I might want to clear out that nest because they, they've been giving me a lot of attention. It's good to see everything got repaired. So I'm guessing, wow, that's a big, <laughs> yeah. So what, what was happening is um, the spitters are getting these. So the walls probably weren't getting too damaged, but the spitters were hitting them. Well, I still have... Let me break this wall. 
Go kill these guys. They might not all be coming from this nest either. Okay. But the reason I did that is I want to... Well, I don't have enough wall for that. But I do have lasers. So I have a blueprint here. Where is it? There it is. So that's what it looks like when it's, when it's done. And I want it to to just lay it on like right here, but I have to pull them up because I, I'm using medium power poles instead of the large ones. A little poor planning on my part, I think. Here, give you some more repair packs. Um, but I left most of my stuff back at base, lasers and stuff, so I'm not gonna worry about it. I'll do it later. How are we looking over here? Batteries, batteries are getting drained by lasers, but they're making a comeback. Plastic is looking kind of pitiful, but it's getting drained pretty hard now by both red circuits and my, um, where is it? Right here, by that. And now that I've got a stack inserter, I can replace it. <clears throat> Needs to go a little faster, I think. Um, it might be time to upgrade everything to blue belts, just so I don't have to worry about it later, but. Okay. You've got everything you need, but you need to output. Same here? Yeah. Same here. Man. Nailed it. Jeez Louise. Okay. What's your problem? You're just making that now? Okay. Well. Go fast. Everything is being slowed down right now by red circuits, red circuits, which is fine, but um, which is a good thing. We want we want to be able to scale up, but I just need to make sure that we can do that. Look at that. Gonna have to upgrade the belts, I think. Green circuits are looking good still. I am drawing off the line, but that's healthy there. It's getting thinned out. But as long as it's making it down here, I'm okay with that. I'll put these up. They are not the issue right now. Let's take a look at our productivity circuits. We did get some, some level threes, which is great. It's fantastic, which means that this is working. So I can turn it off now because I don't really want productivity modules at the moment. But what I do want is I want there you go. I want uh, speed speed modules for sure. And this, by the way, is also the same blueprint for the efficiency modules, which are more useful than productivity, in my opinion. But we don't really need those yet either. We just need... We'll do like that. Okay. Now I can tear that down. <clears throat> and they'll put it somewhere. It'll get moved around. Coal's looking kind of kind of bad. Okay. I think that's kind of uh, that's an emergency situation right now. We need to go deal with that immediately. I will deal with it by laying down red belt on my way up. and uh, placing down more miners. My guess is that the miners have run out. 
about to check power. Yeah, power. So we need more power, first of all. That's a problem. <clears throat> it's getting close to being a crisis. Okay, we will add more miners than we have. Actually, we don't have this many. Okay. I'll come back. I need to pick that up. Good stone. Stone is got just about 10k left. Plus uh, a couple, maybe like a thousand total. <clears throat> okay, we need miners. We need to, before we do that, before I run back up there, I'm going to grab my blueprint for the solar array. And create some more solar uh, solar rays and I will just go continue going east actually I'm gonna fill in some down here as well and since I'm going down there on my way I can grab there he is grab these lasers <clears throat> and I will grab walls. We don't need all of them. Okay. That's more than, way more than enough. So I can kind of kill a few birds with one trip. I'm really thinking pretty soon I'm going to need to um, start creating trains, uh, train networks. Uh, I know I need to resupply the walls with lasers, walls, and repair packs. Um, but it hasn't been totally critical yet. Okay, I'm going to leave, I'm going to make these align. I'm not going to stagger them because I want to be able to run straight down. Looks like this big forest here is going to go bye bye. Let me see, am I lined up? Line up, line up. One, two. And you go down. And then we'll do one here. That's one, two. I'm running out of chests for wood, I think. One, two. No, that's too far, right? No. That's good. And we'll just kind of keep going this way. Two, one, two. Okay, right there. That's four. I'll I'll leave it with four. It'll run out of supplies if I do too many. Even that might be too many, where it's it's not able to make use of most of one because um, supplies are so low. So it's pretty quiet right here. So I, I feel safe tearing this up. I got to remember to do the. Um, where oh, it's in the north. Okay, no damage. All right, guys. Oh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Um, I gotta remember to put down the radars because I forget that. The other dangerous thing is if you pull this up and it's leading out somewhere else that's powered, then those turrets will become unpowered if that's the only source. But I mean, what am I gonna do? Not see. There's good. Okay. We gotta power this back up quickly. Oh, what I was doing before I put a chest down, supplier chest, and dropped in some lasers and some power poles. That way. The local bots could help as well. And um, actually, that was a that's supposed to be a provider chest. The storage chest is for them to drop the junk down that they pick up, or also just hover. Okay, I think that's okay. Let me put down the radar before I forget that. 
and also need to fill in this little section right here. All right, that's good. Okay. I'm sure we are draining power now, but um, that's fine. Care. We'll just build more solar arrays. I can always dis disconnect it if I have to. Disconnect everything. I mean, if I get like to where I can't produce, my assemblers won't run. Um, so I can't produce more solar panels, for instance, then I will just turn it off for a while, turn turn like a couple of the walls off. I mean, it's fine if they get beat up. Okay, where's my wall? That up. And if you do it like this, you just gotta make sure that you line up the power poles as well. Kinda of tricky to do. Okay, there we go. Okay. <clears throat> Come on, put the power pole down right there so we can power everything. Right there. Right there. There we go. I need one there. Okay, everything should be powered up now. Here's the storage chest where they were dumping stuff and I'll pick this up as well. And they were using from our supplies, so I need to make sure I refill that. Put in five lasers. Okay, and then I had a chest over here as well, apparently, with wood in it. So we'll take that out and... Oh, my wood went in there. Okay, I'll take that with me because I can use that. All right, awesome. So we got a wall down here and we got some more solar arrays. Let's look at the power supply. I think it's probably the same. Yeah, so many more. So I'll add some more and I'm gonna end the episode here. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.